Madison Square Garden, New York, before 20,000 spectators, Under Secretary of State Edward Stettinius is greeted by former ambassador to Russia, Joseph Davies, at a rally of the National Council of American Soviet Friendship. Russia's ambassador, Andrei Gromyko, is welcomed to this impressive celebration of the 11th anniversary of the reestablishment of diplomatic relations between the United States and the Soviet Union. Ambassador Gromyko, British Ambassador Halifax, Under Secretary Stettinius, and Ambassador Davies. Ambassador Gromyko emphasizes Soviet United States cooperation. It gives me great pleasure to be present for the second time at the great meeting in Madison Square Garden, dedicated to the date of the re-establishment of diplomatic relations between the United States and the Soviet Union. Our countries are marking the 11th anniversary of the re-establishment of these relations. It is sufficient to give a quick glance at the period since 1933 to convince oneself that the resumption of normal relations between the two countries is really a factor of great potential and historic importance. It is also, it is also unnecessary to speak ex extensively of the tremendous importance which successful cooperation between two such great countries of the world as the United States and the Soviet Union has and will have in the future. Under Secretary Stettinius speaks of the common goal. It is a great honor for me to have this opportunity afforded by the National Council of American Soviet Friendship to speak this evening of the close relationship existing between the United States and the Union of the Soviet Socialist Republics. The friendship between our two countries is a cherished heritage of our people. Our relations have drawn close in the ordeal of this worldwide war in which we have joined our efforts in a joint cause. We are winning this war. <laughs> and our victory will be complete. It will be a, com a common victory wrought by a common effort, one for the common good of the peace-loving peoples of the world. 